Okay, so welcome back guys, this is Yusu Chen here and in today's video what I'm going to be doing or at least attempting is more, more, more Mindplex Yep, I'm gonna do that So, let's get right into the video and we're going to be playing Sky Wars in this episode so I'm like, hmm Yeah, but since this is a voiceover like most of my Mindplex videos are that means that yeah I can commentate on everything I did I did not realize at this point <laughs> that this game was glitched which I wish I would have done cause um yeah cause apparently there was a glitch in the system where only one person could have stayed alive in the entire game and as you can see I didn't realize that sign which means that I'm currently Thinking if I am blind or not, but yeah, hmm. <laughs> and I really liked it obviously. So I went into solo, and yeah, I mean, I was like, oh, what a great gear! Ah, sword, even I, I get everything, I guess, from this map. Then I put up, uh, put on the armor, obviously, and I'm like, hmm, same stuff almost, yeah. And then I almost realize. And now I realize that, that I have zero blocks absolutely in my inventory. So I was like, mm -hmm. how am I going to make it to the other island? And that was my greatest question, question of all time. I checked in both chests if there was no, nothing left there for me. And I was like, hmm, yeah. And I apparently don't know how to chop wood. But then, yeah, I'm like, okay, this is gonna be epic. I can still win, even though I see the enemy literally standing right there. Which, mean, which meant that I was like, mm, yeah, maybe I should just consider, you know, stuff. And I was like, mm, yeah, I don't have enough blocks. But this was the genius move against this kid. So you're going to see it right here. And, um, yeah. I've seen the chat for him. I've seen the chat. <laughs> and there is the replay of this one. Uh, that guy just fell. That guy just fell. <laughs> I don't get it why or how. I mean, how hard is it to stay on the map? I mean, I know that there was a bridge, but like, that missed one thing. But this game, I am genuinely good about the game not giving me any blocks, because it literally won me the game. Almost. I don't mean, like, I almost never do. Uh, yeah, and then I started seeing the, the sword, I switched to the sword, and I'm like, hmm, yeah. At this point, what you should know is that there is really almost no one left on the entire map. Yes. Uh, well. And yeah, as you can see, almost no one left. I believe there was three of us left at this point. But I'm not sure. You know, just checking casually if like anyone or anything up there. Uh, then I start bridging over, obviously, because it's Sky Wars. What else are you meant to do? And then I just see, eh, eh. Well, there is not a lot of things left. I know, there was four of us left at this time. And I will correct myself as many times as I need. Because I did not write a script before this thing. Oh my god. Like I almost never do. And then, yeah. Okay, there was five of us left back then. But now there is three of us, I believe. Uh, and I just see the, the message in the chat that... 
yeah, world begins to crumble, that means I don't have that much time left in the outer section of the world. Which just simply meant, hmm, I have to go to mid. And when I was watching it back and editing it, I just realized this something. That right now, he just fell into the void. I mean, why? I mean, okay, yeah, you, saw, you see me look raging. But here is the dumbest thing of all. Just watch this. See, I landed it, and then I I fell off. What? Yeah, and... Uh, <laughs> yeah, and that was all for the thing, Skywars. So I went on... I believe it's called a Monster Hunter. Yeah, that's what this game mode is called. So I went in there, I was like, hmm, yeah, I'm gonna play one round of it since I played, like, a lot of this before. And since it doesn't require me not lagging, which means, hmm, yeah. But what you should know is that what I was showing at the start is the medic kit. That is the crucial part of this entire thing. Because if you do not have medic kit, then you do not get five cakes. You get like some garbage thing. Like that's called brute rush. That's like it. It, it basically deals more damage. It, it just does not. And I'm like, hmm. Yeah, this is yeah. This is gonna be quite good. And yeah, I was like, hmm, okay, this is l this is low key good. This is kind of nice. I'm gonna just play for a couple of minutes, and I'm gonna be like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I, yeah. But hmm, what you should know is that the round of this thing lasts for about like fifty minutes. So like, if you win the entire event, it lasts 50 minutes. If you don't win the event, it lasts less. And how are you going to know if, you know, if, if it lasts less? Well, you're gonna know it if you just open up the, how much weakness you have. And there, here I was thinking that I can just like simply stack cakes. <laughs> I was like at this point, yeah, this would deserve a thumbnail for this one. Me stacking like five blocks high with cake. And <laughs> it's like, yep. I'm still wondering about what what the thing is going to be. It's more like it's most likely going to be like. Stacking up with cake, by the way, this this kit is a bit broken in early games, so like, if you're alone, then at the end of the thing I'm gonna show you how to manage to entirely, just, you know, just do stuff, like how to get on higher ground. Which this kit is great at, because I'm like, mm, yeah, it, that's the only thing it's good at. So I'm like, mm, yep. Uh, it's epic. And at this point I was like, mm hmm. Well, you know, I was just buying stuff, I was just fighting stuff. And then in between rounds I was like, mm hmm, yep. But yeah, and then, you know, stuff was like, yeah, I was like, mm hmm. Okay, zombie fights, like 84 mobs, I can like get a couple of tokens from it. Which means that as much as I win, I get shards out of, which I can use to buy chests and uh, other stuff. Uh, let me see. I can use it to buy... Um, kits, yeah, that's what I was going for. But that's gonna be almost unnecessary at, at the point of time. Cause, uh, as you may or may not be aware of it, cause I'm gonna tell you guys that I'm gonna get a computer soon. So if, if I don't upload in the first two week, week or two of June, wait, no, 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 June, July, then it's because of my new setup 
you know, everything, but I'm, I'm gonna most likely make a video on it since I don't have a community tab feature yet, which I am wishing that I would have at this point, because I'm like, yeah, mm, it, mm, you know, it's kind of a crucial thing when you have, like, set up things and then, like, other stuff, and it, yeah, and it things like that. But as you can see, yeah, there was just three of us left at this point. Uh, if I can find both of their names, yes, they're right in here. Garax and Lo and Love Gao, I believe that. Yep, Love Gao and uh, Garax and me. That was all three of us left, and I was like, "This is not going well. This is not going well." Because I only have two more cakes left. Which means that, mm, yeah, I kind of wasted like two, no, no, no. Yeah, two of them on a thing, on people who uh, aren't going to survive for that long. And yeah. And I was just starting to be like, okay, that's kind of bad. Because once I start running out of cake, everything goes downhill. Is, you know, uh, it's kind of bad if you if you run out of cakes and you're the healer, because then you're like, hmm, yeah, uh, yeah, the crew is dead unless you have two healers. So at this point, I think the only way to beat the entire mob fight, or mob arena, yeah, that's the name of the game. No, I know it. It's called Mob Arena. It is on high pixel, by the way, but yeah. Basically, the only way to beat the last waves, I believe, is that if all of you, if like one of you has the tank kit, because I don't know what that does. I think it gives you more hearts. That would be kind of nice, which I am going to go for eventually. Because I believe that gives you damage, but I think you need, uh, well, basically I think you need two healers, uh, two tanks, and yeah, that's basically I think what it is. But you can have six players at once, so that means that, well, if I would pick a kit, then I would be a healer. So I would pick like three healers and three tanks, because that, that would be like... The best camp, the best entire camp from every single angle. Because, you know, the other kits are just garbage. In this game mode, I mean, it just basically doesn't matter on what kit you have. Unless you have a um, thing. Like, if you basically choose to have a healer kit. Then, then you're going to be fine, totally. You're not going to be like, oh, I, I regret. I would, I don't want to do that. By the way, can we just have, can we just have like, uh, seven in the chat for all this bow spam? You know, all, all the bow shots hit. Can we just like, this is like all the surviving. It took me all the surviving at all times, and I was like, yeah. This is epic, you know? This is just epic. But then, yeah, I realized... Mm, I have three hearts and no more cakes. This is why I'm telling you to... If you have, if you can assemble your team, then get three healers and three tanks. Because that's going to be good. And, like, the tanks should be people who actually know PvP. Because, uh... If you don't speak PvP or know PvP then you don't do pvp at this point i was just typing that i'm gonna die this round which by the way didn't happen in that round but rather the next round uh i was like yeah i'm gonna definitely die and i was just like we're getting overwhelmed but yeah at this point you can see this is the glitch that i was talking about on how to get up to the ledge I mean, it's quite useful, unless you're facing scatons, which I died to. Yes, and this was where I had to say... This was where I had to say the GG's to the boys, because I was like, hmm. 
GG's guys, and I was like, yep, I'm out, but thank you guys for watching, I will see you guys next time, hope you enjoyed, like and subscribe, bye!